Hey guys! So today I am doing a makeup look inspired by the super amazing talented Huna. Um, her newest music video, Because I'm the Best, came out recently and I'm so in love with it. Like, you guys don't even understand because I used to not like Huna and now I'm... I love her. <laughs> it's a, it's weird. Don't, don't, I don't know why, but, um, I've fallen in love with her and her music lately. So I really wanted to create this look. It's a very bright, kind of 80s inspired look. Um, she had, like, the little pigtails going on and the hoop earrings and, um, was with Ilhun and, like, it was just like a whole 80s vibe and I really loved it. I love um, 80s inspired makeup. So I did this look for you guys today. Um, if you do want to see the smoky look that she had in the video, please let me know in the comments below and I will definitely do that. Um, but this is just a really bright, fun look. Um, yeah, and I got pigtails and hoop earrings and I'm like scared of myself because I'm like, I don't even know who I am. But anyways, if you want to know how I got this look, just stay tuned. Alright, so I started by doing my eyebrow. Um, I tried to do the straight Asian brow, but it did not turn out very well. Um, but you can do your brows however you like. I'm just, I wanted to go with that to kind of go with the look. So, for a primer, I'm going to be using the e.l.f. Smudge Pot in Ain't That Sweet. And it's a really light pink. Like, it looks more beige on camera, but it's pink. And I'm just going to apply that all over my lid. I'm going to take a dark brown eyeliner. This is the Wet n Wild Color Icon in Mink Brown. And I'm just going to kind of line my eyes, the top and the bottom. And to smudge it out, I'm going to use a dark red. I'm using my Beige Cosmetics Take Me to Brazil palette. And I'm using this, the darkest red in the palette. And it has um, more of a brown undertone to it. So I definitely wanted to go with that. And smudge out that brown liner. a Colsusen's Hot Pot. This is a bright uh, neon pink and I'm going to smoke out the edges and blend out to have kind of a bright smoky effect if that makes sense. <laughs> highlight I'm going to use my Milani eyeshadow in Bella Chiffon and I'm just going to take another fluffy brush and lightly place that. We it all. We gambled both the hot I'm going to use my Sephora gel liner and I'm going to make a wing but I'm going to go straight out um, if you prefer a cat eye, you can do that, but I'm just going to go straight out. A heart so love, so here we are, to not to stay, to suddenly. And add mascara, I'm going to use the Urban Decay um, Curling Mascara. And I'm going to add her little freckle. I guess you could call it, um, under the eye, her little beauty mark, and just dab it. Alright, so my eyes and my face are done. I just contoured really heavily because she has amazing cheekbones, and I used a bright pink blush to kind of go with the bright eyeshadow that we have, and I used the Hikari blush in Tango, and it's a really pretty, like, hot pink blush and I just loaded it on because she had a very kind of 80s inspired blush and it was just like tacked on so I love that and then for a highlight I used um, the Balms Mary Luminizer 
I highlighted cheekbones, middle of my nose, forehead, um, and chin. And now, moving on to lips, she had a really, really nice lip. It was kind of pink with a red, um, on the inner portion. I'm going to start on the inner part and use the Urban Decay Super Saturated Lip Pencil. And this is in Theodora. Lose my mind. You're all I have. Just and then taking the NYX Lipstick in Stella which is a really pretty bright pink. I'm going to kind of outline the red. Wasting time, I need some space. I need a little time to run away. And there is the final look. I added a wig and hoop earrings like she had in the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed, and if you want to see the smoky look, please let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to you all of you later. Bye.